Wow. If she's not coming on, this is like, this is, this was her, this was her idea like, hey, to do a fucking phone call about this. Uh, okay. <laughs> this, was, this was her fucking idea. That's what's fucking insane about this. She was set, telling me the whole idea. She wanted to explain that apparently the the pictures that Ch Chad has is pictures she sent. This was her fucking idea. This is insane. She's like, I'll do a phone call thing. I was like, all right, so we'll see if she calls. But I don't want to, I want to give her the benefit of the doubt about this this was i literally was on the phone with her 30 minutes ago and she's like yeah this is this is what we got to do this is what i want to do and now, and now here she is standing me up so <laughs> uh, all right then i'm gonna just say what she told me and this is what it's gonna be uh uh, I'm saying call whenever you want. I'm live. Otherwise, I'm going with the story you said, and I'm going to. <laughs> this is hilarious. This was her fucking idea. This was her fucking idea. And here I am. Uh... <laughs> I, I guess, like, so she had a thing <laughs> with... <laughs> I would not be doing this if this was not her fucking idea. I would I would not be I would not be live right now. This is literally her fucking idea. So I'm like, okay, here we go. Um, so her her side of the story was uh, <laughs> that she, um, so her and Chad. Um, I'm going to say, I mean, I'm just experiencing it now from Kate, kind of bipolar, kind of bipolar. She has one idea one minute, changes her mind literally 15 minutes later. Um, and I was going to stand up for both of them, by the way. I was going to stand up for both of them. So I'll just go through the thing. So, yeah, like I said, like a month ago or a month and a half ago, whatever the hell it was, uh, she's like, hey, um, Chad uh, sent me a sex tape. Do you want it? And I was like, no. I'm like, I, I don't want that. I don't want a sex tape. I want nothing to do with this fucking sex what, what do I care? I don't give shit. I go, you also look like shit if you bring it up. Yeah, I'm like, you look like garbage if you bring it up. Like, no one cares about a fucking sex tape. Like, um, and then I guess like they were going back and forth texting. I guess Chad's trying to get with her. I guess he's like, um, she's got a boyfriend now. And like, he's like talking shit to her boyfriend to, to Kate or whatever. I don't know. I, I, I don't know the whole thing. And then Kate said to uh, Chad that um, she was propositioned by a guy. Like, hey, I'll give you 20 grand. And like, she was just like making jokes. I'm like, hey, she also told me that story. That someone offered her twenty, say, "Hey, I'll give you twenty thousand dollars if uh, if uh, we hook up." And her s story to me today was like, "Yeah, all right, let's say someone did that, and I was gonna do that. Uh, why would I share that money? Why would I share that money with anyone? I, I would just." Grandma Sicardi. Kate's a hooch sack smelled like a little circus, some strawberry, a little passion fruit, and just a hint of asparagus. Bravo, Kate. <laughs> there we go. Hi. Yep. Kate. She's gone. This was literally like her idea. I, uh, I think I'm on Chad's side now. I think I'm switching teams. I think I'm on Chad's side now. This literally was a conversation that we had 30 minutes ago. This was literally her fucking idea, and now here I am. <laughs> Just making is I think this might be a work. I think this might actually be a work. It might be her and Chad planning this together to like Oh God. And no, I don't want to see Chad's sex tape. She offered to send me Chad's sex tape. Like I was like, I d I don't want it at all. I, I don't want it. I don't care to see it. Who gives a shit? Why would you want to see that? Why would anyone want to see that? So there's pictures of your boobs. Who gives a shit? Who gives a shit? Jump out in front of it and fucking own it and move on. And she's like, all right, you're right. I need to do that. And then she is not, not fucking here. Not fucking here. Oh, hung out to dry. Was this all a work? Was, like, was this literally all a work? 
was Chad the one that's like, I got this sex tape, I got this sex tape. Like, Kate, go with it, go with it, go with it. And then it all came to fruition today. And Kate's like, hey, I'm going to tell you the truth about what's going on. And then, like, she, like, stood me up all to the hats, – hats off to Chad. Yeah, it's a – hats off to Chad. If this was all a work by Chad and Kate, they got me. I fell for it. I fell, I fell for it. But um, yeah, I don't know. If, was this a work like uh, like two months ago when Kate's like, "Hey, I got Chad sex tape," like, as a, and I was like, "I'm not into it. I'm not into it. Like, fucking, what wh what do I care?" And here I am. Here I am. Jesus Christ! I hear you, dude. Bluff chatter, race killing it. First, he gets exclusive with an amateur nunchucker, and tonight he's booked a professional. But f too easy, yeah. I fell for it. I fell for it. I fell for it. I fell for it. I was literally on the phone with her 30 minutes, 20 minutes before this, and she's like, yeah, all right, let's fucking do it. And I was like, all right, cool. She's like, I don't want to be on camera. I'm going to call in. I was like, okay, cool. I fell for it. I'm the, yeah, I got, uh, yeah. Thank you, beloved chatter. <laughs> Who's going to, got stood up again? Huh? Yeah, I did. I did. I got stood up. Yeah, if you remember my uh, fucking joke from my dry bar special. Yeah, I got stood up. My first date ever, I got stood up. I got stood up. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I stood up. I definitely got stood up, Leo Gunn. I'm not. <laughs> I fuck. <laughs> I get stood up by Kate. I got stood up by Leo Gunn before, who's still a good man. I like Leo Gunn. He's a good man. Um, but yes, I got. Yeah, I definitely got stood up. I think it's hilarious. So it's all right. I'm I'm having fun with this. I'm. Yeah, I got stood up. I definitely got stood. Literally, like just got off the phone with her. Like, yeah, this is a good idea. Let's let's do this. Jump out in front of it, and then like nothing. A ghost town. Tumbleweeds. Tumbleweeds. I tell you, tumbleweeds. By the way, I got to move to the desert, dude. The desert's a place to be. It's great for your fucking sinuses. It's great for your allergies. I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move to Arizona. That's where I gotta go. I'm going to go to Arizona, dude. It's, like, just better for you. Um, so I guess uh, what Kate was saying is, I don't know where the fuck she is. This was her fucking idea. All right, I'm just sitting here alone with my fucking dick in my hand. I had a great time in the Bahamas, dude. I was I was very gay. I blew a bunch of dudes. It was good times. We saw yeah, that. Yeah, right? saw. I blew all the dudes. All, every dude I met, I blew them. Proud of Chad for having a real sex day and prove him out right. Yeah, exactly, Theo. I'm with you. This is a victory for Chad. Let's give it up for Chad. Chad won today. This is not a fucking victory for Chad. What are you talking it's about? It's a there victory is. for Chad. I'm calling this name of this episode is victory for Chad. Chad wins. I'll get props when props are due. He won. He won. Give it up for him. He won. That. No, he did I not. Lost, he won. Won I lost, he won. I lost, he won. I lost, he won. I'm calling this victory for Chad. And be like, hey, 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 hey. Okay, fuck you, Doom. Goodbye. I'll do it like that show. Goodbye. Goodbye.